Hi guys. Hey everyone. Welcome to Make Two and another episode of our Sims 4 Let's Play focusing on the Eden Cho family. In the last episode, Jamie Eden told his family that he was thinking about being a chef as a career. And unfortunately for him, his grandmother Shelly did not seem to really like that idea too much. No, he tried to cook a meal for everybody, sort of showing off that yes, he could do it. And she was like, no, stop cooking. Yeah, I think it's because she is a snob. She's got that snob trait, you know? Yeah. And maybe she thinks that it's just not such a prestigious career for a grandson of hers to be a huh. chef. Maybe. All these roommates are here in the gym acquiring skills. Yes, although, this is the gym of the university. Yeah, although Bon and Jonas are not working out. Is it because <laughs> they don't have any equipment? Uh, they don't know there's a spare run there's a spare running machine, well, there's a spare exercise machine. Maybe they're not interested. How about yeah. ask about day, maybe? Yeah, why not? <laughs> oh, she could show off her muscles to him. Yeah. She had that discuss fitness techniques. Okay, so you're sort of doing fitness. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't Kinda, look that into yeah. it. Yeah. Kind of an awkward smile. It is seven yeah. thirty on a Friday evening, so yeah. maybe she's not super into it. But it looks and like look, everyone else is. Everyone is trying. Yeah. yeah. I don't know whose idea it was to come and say, hey, house, let's get fit. I'm going to say it was Jamie's idea. He was the first one down That's here true. and then was, everyone else came down. Yeah. I, this person is Abigail. Okay. Oh. Looking good. Yeah. I. Th oh. whoa, whoa, Jamie. Oh. I think um, maybe Jamie would like to show off his cooking skills for his girlfriend, Abigail. What do you think? I think that's a great idea. He yeah. failed with his family, but I don't think he's going to fail with Abigail. Yeah. And I think, like, the fact that all the roommates are here right mm -hmm. now means it's probably a good time to make his escape and have maybe a nice romantic little dinner together. I agree. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's not travel with any of these people. Nope. Just let's one of only them. travel with Abigail and let's just take them home. Yeah, we said a couple of episodes ago that it's hard to get privacy when you live in a house with eight people. Yeah, so you gotta grab it where you can. Exactly. So everyone started their training session, which Jamie set up. Yeah. <laughs> if he's the one into fitness, he's like, hey guys, let's all go and get fit. And then, bounced. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, all right, let's go ahead yeah. and do some cooking. What? A uh, gourmet meal? Yeah. Makes sense. Mm-hmm. Um, Butternut gnocchi? For, oh. Ooh, skill level two. Okay, well, he's there. He can do that. Okay, let's, yeah. let's do a family size. Okay. <laughs> I mean, otherwise he's only making one serving. Oh, I see. So I thought it said two. It was level two. Level two. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so he's got to make two. I think butternut gnocchi is a good one for a date <laughs> night. It's not yeah. too heavy. Hopefully she'll like yeah. appreciate the fact that he's making her a meal. She's a gourmet sort of meal. outside the house. What are you doing, Abigail? This is your house too, you know? Yeah. The thing about this Let's Play is, of course, we've said before, we're only controlling Bon and Jamie and letting the rest of the roommates kind of do their own thing. It's sort of like a variation on the I Live With Idiots challenge where you only control one sim in the house and let everybody else kind of do whatever comes to their minds. So yeah. she is apparently <laughs> out on the porch and... I don't know. She was a little weird at his birthday dinner, too. Like, I know. I'm not sure that she takes this relationship as seriously as one might. Well, maybe that's another reason why Jamie is trying his hand. Like, if he can convince yeah. her about his great cooking skills, what greater way to woman's heart than through her stomach, <laughs> as the saying goes. Now, while we're here, I want to point out on the top left of the screen, Dare yes. the Dead, nine out of nine. Yeah, we completed all of those. I had Jamie just go around town collecting all these skulls. For, like, all of an afternoon. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't too exciting. Basically, you just kind of find people who are walking around town in their mask and fancy outfit, and you get to know them a little bit and then ask them for a skull and you collect all nine and put them in this display case here yeah so he's got a good. whim to chat with abigail i think maybe you know he could it's call dinner. her i think dinner's ready yeah let's although this is just left on the french toast some roommate has left oh, french toast buzz nut. okay let's see call, uh, to, meal. call to meal yeah very good <laughs> Maybe she's just enjoying being outside. Maybe she's like <laughs> standing guard for some reason, making sure no one else comes home. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't, don't know. know. Uh, I mean, you know, we're talking about whether she's serious or not. I don't know how serious Jamie actually is. I mean, obviously they are living together in this house. So that is something that is yeah. a step in a relationship. But 
Like Yeah, they're not in the same room. They're in whole different wings of the house. Yeah. So but having said that, if the relationship did go south, Jamie Eat. Eat together. Oh my god. If the relationship did go south, it's pretty awkward with both of them living in the same house. Mm. Or it might not be awkward, because like I said, if he's not that serious about it, and yeah, she's not it's that true. serious about if it, it ends like, amicably. Right. It's not a big deal. I mean, they only got together towards the end of high school after yeah. Jamie had been living the single life for a long time. And it was kind of physical. Are you guys gonna like chat, maybe chat, <sighs> like, sit, chat together? This is not a good talk, sign. <laughs> talk to each other. We were like gossiping about this thing. Oh, what might happen? And Feed a bite. Ooh. I don't think I've seen that before. No. You mentioned canoodling. Mm-hmm. This is not a uh, pre-canoodling dinner. Right. I was hoping it would be a little more romantic than this. He's eating while surfing. Come on. She is looking spaced out. <laughs> Let's do this, Jamie. Come on. He's just... he. Yeah. Oh, gosh. He's she's, cooking for one. She's, she's maybe... Done. She's like, mm. You know I really I mean? wanted oh. to see that feed a bite interaction. Okay, well, well, that was a bit awkward. <laughs> huh, huh. Well, maybe just get straight to the kissing. Maybe that's all she's into. I think she's, she's, yeah. Okay, well, let's let's do this feed a bite thing. Can we do that? Oh, where'd it go? To, I think you got to click on Abigail. Really? Feed a bite. Come on. Come on. Okay, if this doesn't work. She's got to appreciate just his kiss cooking. Her. I know. She doesn't seem <laughs> particularly supportive girlfriend. That's not feeding a bite. Yeah, that's uh, just gazing into each other's eyes. Awkwardly, I'm going to say. No conversation. Oh, just like, nope, she nudged his okay, shoulder. Okay, she's into it. Oh, there we okay. go. That's what we want. You know. Okay, maybe they're not into the... The, like... <laughs> Make out romance. Yeah, the like, romance it's of a the bit dinner. Too serious. They're a bit more physical, I would say, than Bon and J- exactly. Bon and Matt. Bon and Matt are like friends, and they love each other and stuff like that. Jamie and Abigail are just probably more this make is out a buddies. <laughs> full on make out session though. But hey, you know, friends with benefits when you're a student sharing a house is not that bad. <laughs> friends with benefits. I will say they're actually in a relationship. They're exclusive. That's. As far as we know. Yeah. Yeah. They're actually having this thing to make out in a closet. Like, we didn't um, prompt that, but I, I guess, well, are they going to do that? Oh. It's got an X in it, though. I don't know why. I don't know. Yeah. Okay, well, they're talking maybe. again now. I just think maybe she's not hungry. Okay. <laughs> I don't want them to woohoo in a bush. No, like, I mean, they're in a house. Yeah. They can't. They could woohoo in a house. <laughs> Goodness, I don't know. There just doesn't seem to be a ton of like stuff going on, and it looks like make out in closet. Come on, I want to yeah, see the make out in that. closet. Make out in closet. Oh, it looks like the roommates are home too. Oh. Well, all the better for going in the closet. Please put the closet <laughs> nearby. Okay. There go. Oh, Charlie's right there. Charlie's like, I'm gonna look the other way, guys. Oh Whoop. dear. All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is a fun interaction. Yeah. It's not full on woohoo. It's just making out. Mm-hmm. What was it called? Like seven minutes in heaven or something? Or yeah, the party game. Yeah, yeah. What is Charlie doing? He's like snooping. Uh, everyone seems a bit spaced out. <laughs> yep. I guess they're all uh, tired from their working out. They're long. <laughs> Nothing happened, guys. Whoa. Where'd Jamie Whoa. go? He's. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. Oh, she seemed okay with that, I guess. So yeah. while they might not be serious, they at least have some chemistry together. Yeah, that is true. They might not have a lot to talk about together, <laughs> but they certainly have their time. <laughs> he still has this thing that says, make out in closet. I guess we'll... Uh, yeah, I, maybe I that'll go away at some on. point. I don't know. I wanted also to check out this fire pit out here, which I had set up. Yeah, with all those cool deck chairs, garden chairs. Yeah. How about, ooh, ooh tell, tell a group, group story. story. Who could light this and, yeah, tell a group Maybe story. Maybe Bond could tell a group story. Fairy tale about an... Ooh, fairy tale about an enchanted snake. Okay. <laughs> oh, um, we can tell the whole household. That's sweet. Who is... Oh, Max is one of his friends from doing that. From doing the Day of the Dead challenge. Yeah. Okay, let's wait just an hour or two of sim time for everyone <laughs> to get together. <laughs> right. Abigail's like, mm, do you want to kiss and make out? Because I'm not that interested in stories. 
<laughs> okay. Come on, Bon. You're a good girl. You're going to get there for the story. You've probably heard the story countless times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this ooh, reminds me, fire. like, ooh, tense. Why tense? I Who's don't know. Tense? Okay. Maybe we, does it say down there? No. Cozy campfire, happy. He, Jamie's happy. Oh. Just somebody in the group is tense. Right. <laughs> Are y'all going to sit? <laughs> Set out all these mismatched chairs out for uh, everybody, just specifically for them. I think this is what differentiates Sims 4 from Sims 3 Play. In Sims 3 Play, everyone loves to sit. Yeah. Uh, how about... Okay, I think that... I think he's told the story. <laughs> I think it was met with lukewarm reception. Okay, he's going to invite everybody to hang out just for a little bit. I mean, Jamie is the sociable dude. There yeah. we go. Come on, guys. Enjoy yeah. the time at the fire. Mabel is warming her hands. I got her name right. Yes, not Pinkie Pie. No, no. And this is Charlie. Charlie. Nadine. Nadine. Jonas here. These are the four Jonas. new roommates. Oh, the fire looks like it's running low. Ooh. Someone needs to squirt some stuff on it. Roast. Add a log. Add a log, yeah. That and then we'll roast. What can we roast? Ooh, marshmallows. Yeah, yes. that's cute. <laughs> yeah, I can just... This is sort of like the ideal student house for me, just having a whole bunch of people with different personalities and you just kind of have somebody to talk to basically whenever you want. And just some fun times by a fire outside. Yeah. An outside fire would be really nice. Mm. Not so easy in an apartment living, but if you have a house with a yard, mm -hmm. very nice to have a fire pit, and roast some marshmallows. Only Jane is eating. Oh, too hot. But Jane is enjoying the marshmallows, I guess. I think Bon and Charlie get along pretty well. They're sort yeah. of drawn to each other to chat a lot. He's a nice dude. <laughs> hmm. What's this? Uh... Jane is just trying to. Tell Happy Gale a story. She's like, yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think they probably think that the each one of them thinks the other one is pretty cute, but don't know about long term. Yeah. And, you know, maybe if the housemates hadn't come home just as they started making out in the closet. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they're definitely good at flirting. Okay, well, it's getting pretty late. Bond's Ooh, thinking about aliens. Yes. Maybe she's thinking about her little sisters. Well, also in the last episode, we had been thinking about giving Bond a job as a scientist. She checked out the science lab on campus and had a sort of fun time playing with all the equipment. So it might be good at this point to try and give her a proper job as a scientist. And I mean, she might be the only working person in the household. <laughs> someone needs to earn some money. Yeah, someone I mean, does. Jamie's is definitely on a career path. I think he likes cooking. You know, he's going to prove his grandma wrong. <laughs> but he hasn't got a job out of it yet. He's still, I guess, learning. Bon, yeah. Can take an internship being a scientist while still at college. That makes sense. Yeah. She's doing the cleaning up in the background there. That's funny. I think she and Nadine are the only clean yeah. people in the house. Like, nobody else is interested. Ooh. <laughs> Meanwhile, yeah, Jamie and Abigail are still just by themselves, flirting outside by the fire. Yeah. <laughs> works out you yeah. know okay so let's give bon a job mm. okay where is she oh she's feeling energized that's a perfect time to get mm -hmm. a job i think she can do it on her mobile phone can't she that's a strange place to do the washing up girl <laughs> okay let's see career and household find a job there we go she's got a whim to woohoo with matt well uh. <laughs> oh talking to nadine Maybe Nadine's giving her some encouragement mm, while she applies for a looking job. Looking over, saying, which jobs do you want? Okay. Uh, yeah, we think scientist. Mm -hmm. Let's see, days of the week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. That works out. 10 till 7. So this is going to be a full-on internship. Yeah. I think she's going to learn a lot. Okay, she's now a junior tinkerer. Cool. And she's telling <laughs> Nadine that she got it. That's pretty good. She's going to start paying the bills. <laughs> I think Nadine is He's telling like, her it's going to be, <laughs> yeah, could be fun, could be a bit stressful as well. Yeah, she's going to go and listen to music. Bon is probably going to do a bit more research about scientist career on the computer, <laughs> I think. I like her strutting about all energized. She's, funny. Yeah, she's feeling confident. She's got a job yeah. now. Cool. Maybe she tells, Jamie's like, congratulations. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> All right, guys, it is Saturday morning after the night where Bon got her big job, so she's just having breakfast with the ladies of the house. Looks like Matt and Jonas had a bit of time outside. Matt's not looking so no. <laughs> happy. Jonas is thinking about Matt. Um, Maybe oops. they went for a run or something. Yeah, they, they look their, like... I mean, everyone's still in their fitness clothes. But. Mabel's smelling. Oh, I, saw, I saw something coming off of her. Ew, <laughs> gross, dude. Hey, she lives an alternative lifestyle. This is an uncomfortable conversation. Okay... I don't know why. Uh, I don't Maybe know. because Mabel smells. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, getting a bit of an odd vibe in the house. Yeah. That's a shame, because you would have thought if they're both into running or something, that would be good for them to get closer. Maybe they just had a, a disagreement. It looks like the girls are like, this is an uncomfortable yeah. conversation we're leaving. <laughs> <laughs> bon is maybe a little bit socially... <laughs> I don't yeah. know, <laughs> clueless or something. She's just like, I'm eating my breakfast. I'm watching my stories on TV. <laughs> well, Jonas strikes me as like a really athletic type of dude. Mm -hmm. Maybe he and Matt tried to work out together and didn't really have a fun time because, I don't know. Yeah. You know how some Competition? guys, yeah, they get into competitions when they're Who could working run out. faster or something. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, who's crying? I don't know. Oh, it looks like Mabel. She's sad. Aww. I don't know why she's sad. Maybe someone said she smells. <laughs> <laughs> looks okay. like Bond's going to be doing some... Oh! <laughs> Lighting a fire for some reason. Yeah. <gasps> her oh, arm, no. her, her arm lit on fire. Gosh. Okay, here's Mabel. She seems okay. Maybe okay. she just had a little brief crying yeah. jag. You just gonna leave that fire lit unsupervised, she, Bon? She just likes lighting fires. Remember the bluffs? She just like lit that fire when she was first started going out with Matt. <laughs> yeah. When okay. they first lit a started fire. dating, really, in some ways, mm -hmm. it was their first day together. Oh, okay. Mm. The little lovebirds. I think they have a good equilibrium. <laughs> the two of them, like, they're not necessarily gonna get married. They're not necessarily thinking about marriage, but. Yeah. I think they seem in a similar-ish place. <laughs> he just needs to take a shower, I think. <laughs> Get a fresh set of clothes on. I like Nadine's hair. Me too. It's really cute. Yeah. I tried to give everybody different hairstyles because I didn't want them all to look the same. Yeah. And I also tried to give them all different body types as well, or, you know, somewhat different body types anyway. Because I, again, didn't want them to look the same. It's nice that Bon and Abigail get along well. Yeah. I'm not sure that Bon necessarily gets along well with everybody else in the house. Maybe she, I mean, she gets along with Charlie pretty well. Yeah. But the other girls, I don't know. She doesn't spend so. that much time with it. But I think, it, you know, she's more of a slowly building up in relationships. Yeah. Charlie seems super easy. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, he's the kind of guy who's like always working out. I don't know. I did yeah, give him some doing treats a lot, for that. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to have Bon ask him about fitness techniques. Okay. <laughs> he seems to always be doing something. Yeah, he just looks like he's looking and saying, hey, everyone see that? Do you see what I did? <laughs> Bon's like, really? What's up with you? Yeah. You always have to work out. Just trying to make some gains, he says. <laughs> yeah, he seems very enthusiastic about it. Oh, but she's got a burnt Oh, no, arm she did. For three hours. Well, oh. you silly girl, you shouldn't have... Put that lighter fluid on the fire. Hmm. All right, she seems to be. Okay, he's giving her some good his, advice, yeah. maybe. Talking about sets and reps and stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> See, I think she's gradually getting on with different people in the house. Oh, yeah. somebody's calling her. You and I haven't always gotten along, but maybe we can become friends. What do you say to breakfast at the diving pelican? All right. I say, yeah. I don't know who this person is to say that they didn't always get along. I know. It sounds like... It's it was a personal invitation. Yeah, yeah, like, you know, we have some history and let's yeah. bury the hatchet Maybe they're or at high school together hmm. in the same class. Hmm. Ooh, we just got bills. Ooh, 5,000 5, bills. How? <gasps> it's what? not that big a house. <laughs> is it based on the number of people in the house, maybe? Oh, maybe. Oh, God, that's a lot of money. Good thing she just got a job. <laughs> yeah, like she might also be having to ask. I think everyone's going to have to ask their parents for a loan. Mm. She's earning 39 simoleons an hour. <laughs> right? <laughs> Ouch. Okay, so this is Carly. I guess they have a history. I don't remember mm -hmm. seeing this person ever. Agreed. But 
Well, anyway, so this is the Diving Pelican restaurant. I set it up on Windenburg Island, or, you know, that, like, little island that's to the southwest of the main Windenburg area. Mm-hmm. This so is what, near see. where Matt used to live. Yeah, actually, it might even be the same it lot. It might be, because I can see the, the dock. <laughs> yeah, Oops. this is a nice restaurant. Yeah. We it need is. to design some of our own restaurants. I know, it'd be fun. <laughs> yeah, we kind of have fallen behind on designing yeah. stuff, but this is really cool. I just like the idea of this being like a seafood restaurant that's right near a dock. Agreed. You know, maybe they get their fresh catch every day. Yeah. Do you know what I really respect about Bon? What? This is her second breakfast. <laughs> First breakfast at 7.30, second breakfast at 10.30. I, it's probably going to technically be her 11sies. Oh, speaking of parents. Oh, look. And who is that? Jeffrey Landgrab. I think he's <laughs> a friend of the family. Okay. Yep. And yeah, it's a so small world. Speaking of um, parents, like maybe she can talk to Maya at some point before Maya leaves. That would be nice. <laughs> Say hello to mom. Okay, so okay. this is 11sies or brunch as you might I think call brunch, it. brunch, yeah. I'm going to go for coffee Mm -hmm. for the both of them. And... What are you thinking food-wise? Well, this place serves all sorts. (laughs) (laughs) It is a fish restaurant, though. Even gets up to lobster thermidor for 30 simoleons. That's kind of hefty. I remember when Dylan made that for Maya. Mm, On their honeymoon. (gasps) Exactly. I'm going to go for cheesy bread. It's sort of like French toast-ish. It looks like French toast. Yeah, and... For brunch, I personally like to have savory kind of meals. Okay. Yeah, savory, hearty meals to get me going for the day. Okay, so while we're doing that, let's just maybe get to know this lady, because I really don't know who she is. Yeah. (laughs) Now, is she an adult, or was she a young adult? I think an adult. Okay, so they definitely don't know each other from high school, then, if she's an adult. Oh, she's a painter. Oh. Oh. Maybe she knows her vaguely through Maya somehow, because yeah. Maya owns an art gallery. Exactly. Maybe she's like a painter at a at another art gallery in yeah. somewhere around town, and maybe Maya, she just yeah. wants to get to know Bon a little bit. Maya also has an art club, doesn't she? She yes, has a she painting does. club, maybe so she maybe wants from to get the club. In the club. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at this view. That is lovely. Yeah, sailboat out there in the water. <laughs> okay, yeah, intro conversation about llamas, always a good thing mm-hmm. if you're a sim. Mm-hmm. Breaks the ice. Exactly. Everybody likes to talk about llamas. <laughs> <laughs> looking a little bit <laughs> dazed. She's looking a little bit like, I'm still not sure why you invited me, but I guess I'll talk about my boyfriend. Yeah. <laughs> He's great for these many reasons. Yeah. He likes fishing. He likes all the things I do. Yeah. Okay. Wow. I'd love to get to know him. That's sure. nice. Well, it seems to be going well. They definitely are bearing the hatchet for whatever went wrong with them before. Mm-hmm. Don't ask for a loan. It's just <laughs> awkward. Don't ask for a loan when you got your mom just sitting over there. <laughs> Ooh, talk about aliens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mmm. Ooh, uh, Bon seems positive about aliens, but this Carly seems not positive about aliens. Okay, this could be one of those awkward conversations, and yeah. it's like, uh... It's like my sisters are Actually, aliens? I've got two, and then it's like, oh, well, I'm sure they're nice. Right. Mm. I'm sure they're not like other aliens. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Was it said before, there may well be some prejudice in Simtown against yeah, aliens. Yeah. People with blue skin, clearly different. Yeah. We'll have to see when the, the kids grow up. Ooh, this waitress is kind of hanging out for some reason. Yeah. Uh, she doesn't look super happy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's restaurant interactions. Oh, okay. Oh, well, she's gone now. Oh, okay. Well, we'll know for next time, mm. but maybe that's why she was hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> well, this looks like a tasty small meal to have. Yeah. Every time I, I see Sims eat, I'm kind of like, oh, that looks nice. I know. I I'm, might I'm, actually like some of that myself. Yeah, we ate just before we started recording, but I'm already hungry looking at them. <laughs> okay, so Maya is over here enjoying her chatting time with what's-his-face, yeah. Mr. Landgrab. And let's go ahead and greet Maya. And maybe... Hmm. Oh, hmm. she can become best friends with her. Yeah. That's nice. I think technically she's best friends with Matt. Maybe. I think so, yeah. yeah. She's been best friends, I think, over her time since we've been with her. Yeah. Maya and Jamie. And Matt. Mm-hmm. Alright, she's going to come over to hug Maya. It looks like she's yeah. finished her meal. Okay. But still drinking her coffee. 
Quina. Dibble with Varspa. Flerna. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Okay. <laughs> well, she seemed in deep conversation with her friend there. Yeah. Oh, lovely. Oh, yes. <laughs> just giving her I've got a job. Yeah, that's nice. Now I can be. eat. <laughs> <laughs> but in the meantime, maybe we could have a bit of help oh. ask for a small loan because we've got a 5,000 yeah. Samoan bill coming due and not starting work until Monday. So oh, no. just a little bit of help, Mom, please. Here you go, Bon. Try to pay it back when you can. 500. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I don't know how the loans work. Like, are they tracked in some... I don't think so. Yeah, I think it's just kind of... Okay. You get some money. Especially and... when it's from a parent. Yeah. For when it's from a parent, it's not really a loan. It's more like a gift. Oh, so yeah. her person has gone. Okay, leaving Bon with the bill. <laughs> nice. No wonder they didn't get along. Oh, I, think, I think I see her coming back from the uh, okay. bathroom, so it's right. okay. It's okay. <laughs> Let's not judge her too quickly. <laughs> oh, paying was much quicker than I thought it would be. Yeah. So, all right, looks like the meal is over. Maybe Bon made a new acquaintance. I'm not sure that I would consider them friends, but at least they're not enemies. They had a pleasant enough meal. It wasn't like the most bubbly and happy, but it was okay. It was mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Cool aquariums, huh? I know. Well, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Please let us know in the comments what you think. And if you're new to our channel, feel free to subscribe because we've got plenty more Sims 4 on the way. Thanks for watching.